the Inspector General of Police, represented by the Assistant Inspector General of Police, Gaba Uma, who has Interpol, said the department received a petition about some individuals who blackmailed and extorted money from government officials, prompting it to swing into action by inviting them while others fled the country. He added that the Interpol wrote to the whistleblower who brought information to the House, stressing that part of his responsibility was to assist law enforcement agents with tools to carry out the investigation. The police boss pointed out that the Interpol is a different arm of the police force and has different responsibilities, noting that the Interpol has nothing to do with national police and therefore cannot be used to winchant anyone. Those who may be able to answer are those who investigated the matter and the office of the Antony General who wrote to me requesting for assistance. They wrote an attached document and those are the ones that can answer all these questions they are asking Mr. Chairman. But I assure you, we are not investigating. We are trying to assist law enforcement agencies to get the people that they mentioned on the run. Earlier, Chairman of the Adult Committee on the remark below demanded to know why the whistleblowers who came to give more details to the House were being haunted and disclosed that one of the whistleblowers was supposed to be at the hearing but was afraid to come. At the instance of a whistleblower of Mexican citizenship about the existence in China of millions of barrels of Nigeria's crude this individual expressed an interest to purchase the screwed, which the government at the time allegedly needed to investigate first. So this committee went to China, confirmed the existence of this screwed, but this individual concerned alleges that when the process for selling this screwed commenced, they were no longer contacted and they have, have evidence of the fact that the crude was sold without the money being remitted to the coffers of the Nigerian government. The committee however urged the police to collaborate with the committee in order to unravel the truth behind the alleged illegal sale of crude oil. Oliver Ijogbe, EBS News.